Bedminster, New Jersey, it's July of 2021. Donald Trump had been staying at his private golf club, where he had a conversation with two of his staffers and a writer and a biographer who were working on a Mark Meadows memoir about his time as Trump's chief of staff. The recording, first obtained by CNN, begins with Trump talking about accusations he wanted to attack Iran as a way to stay in power after the 2020 election. These are bad, sick people. Claims he appears to deny by referring to attack plans he says were drawn up by the Department of Defense, not him. Except it is like highly confidential, yeah. secret. <laughs> this is secret information. At times, you can hear papers being shuffled. All sorts of stuff. It's pages long. Look. Wait a minute. Let's see here. With Trump appearing to acknowledge the sensitive nature of the documents. Uh, yeah. See, as president, I could have did less. Yeah. Uh, now I can't, you know, but this is yeah, less. If it is admissible in court, it's certainly troubling for their defense. The recording appears to contradict Trump's initial defense that he wasn't holding classified materials in this moment. I didn't have a document per se. There was nothing to declassify. These were newspaper stories, magazine stories. It's a claim he's standing by. And what was said was absolutely fine and very, very perfectly. We did nothing wrong. This is a whole hoax. Despite his legal problems, Trump remains the Republican presidential nominee frontrunner, prompting some desperate pleas for change from within the party. There's just simply no question that uh, he's unfit to be the president of the United States. You know, accountability really matters. Trump hinted at a rally. His legal problems may intensify, suggesting there could be developments in another investigation in Georgia, looking into his alleged attempts to overturn the 2020 election. Katie Simpson, CBC News, Washington.